Once again, live po tayo as here we go. It is Kaya in their familiar yellow home kits playing from left to right. Save for that early pressure from Kaya. It seems they have uh, taken a tentative approach here as Gayoso volleys this one. And that is the first legitimate challenge for Dimitri Makapagkal. However, someone gets in the way. That's Giganto again, very active from his spot to Daiso. Play goes on, looks like it's advantage. Volley again, and that's the opening goal. Harvey Gayoso, the resistance has been broken once again. Harvey Gayoso, the opening goal here for Kaya FC Iloilo. We'll see that once again here. Take us through this, of course, Giganto first. And then this was what I was talking about. Looked like a broken play. It was just recycled by Gayoso right there. Lots of time here. ADT has a penchant for equalizing, for coming back. We'll see how this match unfolds. Bugas able to stay onside. Dennis Chung, it is still play on. Oh, the equalizer for ADT. What a sequence. That Tiki Taka passing you were talking about, Ivan, and the finish. Classic, classic play from ADT. Perfect passing from the wings. Long ball attempt. Straight to Bugas. Chest that perfectly to Chung. Finds his way to the center in Aldiguer. Cool and calm finish for the youngster. I like what you mentioned, perfect cutback for the trailing Andres Aldiguer, who slots it in with power. Giganto, babawi ba ang kaya? Oh, that one sent to the skies. Unfortunate miss for uh, Milad. Uh, other teams, they've had to pay for those errors. Meanwhile, the lob, the header, it goes wide. Sorry, miss. Could have been. Go. Kaya in yellow playing from right to left. ADT in their all red fighting kits. Playing from left to right. Incursion here early on. And Melisa the cut. It is in! What a dream start to the second half for Kaya FC Inuilo. Taizo Horikoshi. Perfect execution on the counter. And that, folks, is. A key difference maker in this match. And Janjan Melisa for the hard work. Oh, mistake from Eric Galiantes. Melisa ran so hard. And just crossed it over to Horikoshi, who did not miss from point blank range. And uh, that particular time, wala ka na magagawa if you were the keeper, uh, Dimitri Makapagkal. Blindsided ka na talaga doon. Late recovery. So it will be uh, a good play game of chess in the next. Uh, Minutes. Milad to Daiso and now Milad again. It is wide. Sorry, miss. But chance after chance for Kaya. They can sense blood here. They try to connect. In the middle, it is collected. A bit of an errant pass there. And luckily for them, Zach Panson at the right place at the right time. Muenz is one of the uh, new players. Now part of the pitch here for the ADT. Just getting confirmation. Uh, Sino yung pangalawa? Threading that needle. Daiso stays onside. No one else to beat. And he punches it in. Daiso Orikoshi completes the brace. And Kaya has taken control as they double the lead. Well deserved goal from Kaya FC. Perfect timing on the run from Daiso Horikoshi. Good pass from Bigandom. Finding Horikoshi on the left flank all alone. Smack that ball straight to the post and in. Perfectly timed that uh, threading of the needle was for Bekandom. Just seeing uh, the chink in the armor, so to speak. From back to front, they concede possession somehow. And Dennis Chung, space has opened up, chooses his left on the fake, the incursion. And that is the second goal for ADT. Askel's development team. Take a look here. Smart passing from the ADT. Chung finding Cholo Bugas there. Fakes on his left, strikes on his right. Zach Banson pinned in his position. And Fitch was going to get there on time. And the play goes on, says the referee. Five minutes of added time confirmed. Someone has been decked for Kaya. Play continues. Saud maneuvers the shot. Rota is there to bother. And finally, Fitch will clear this to a more favorable position. 
As Daiso gets stripped, and that is an obvious whistle. Nano, taken short, Bidik, and they win another. And that is confirmation, Kaya FC Inuilo by the skin of their teeth. They hold on, they overtake Cebu by a 3-2 win over the Ascos development team.